Little Mac, Little Mac, Little Mac, does there exist a shittier character in this entire game than Little Mac? I'll save you the time and effort of actually answering that question. No! I mean, the fucker can't jump for God's sake! What was Nintendo thinking with this guy? The fact that there are people out there who unironically main Little Mac makes me want to dolphin dive onto a highway even more than I already do. I mean, these people are some grade A degenerates. Today, I become one of those degenerates in the name of science. I've learned this character like the back of my hand, and unsurprisingly, he's brain dead easy. A fucking trained toucan could master this character, which which I'm pretty sure encompasses like 80% of all Little Mac players as is. Just take a quick look at what you do with this character. All you gotta do, you hang back, you relax, and you punch the fuck out of people! God, this character is so stupid! How to Little Mac, baby! Let's do it! Despite Little Mac being a sad, pathetic man, that he makes up for it with the fact that he hits like a goddamn truck. Take a look at Edgy Pit over here. Looks like a girl, sounds like a girl, gets fucked like a girl. Rules of nature. Yeah, pretty terrible life you got there, Dark Pit. You might as well just walk off the edge of the stage and kill yourself. Yeah, way to go, fucko. You fell right into my trap. Get pranked, shitter. I'm the best. Every Little Mac player knows that the best possible thing to do with him is to sit next to an edge and camp your opponent. You might be thinking to yourself, sounds a bit dangerous considering this character character has negative recovery, but if you play as flawlessly as I do, then it won't be an issue. In other words, just stop being bad. Little Mac has the uncanny ability to hit people so hard that similarly to ex-NFL stars, their beaten and bruised brains drive them to suicide. As harrowing as that truth may be, they're fucking dead now, so don't worry about it. Now we got some stupid banana cosplaying meathead over here. Go back to your own shitty fighting game, you know? Street Fighter V only has a pitiful roster of 16 characters as is, you don't really have time to waste in this glorified party game, Ryu. You know, you can try to throw me off the stage all you want, but my amazing recovery skills are gonna keep me alive and well, and my amazing punching abilities are gonna keep you dead and sad! Just like me on the inside. I wish I was joking. <laughs> Big boys, unplug your controller! This game is done, there is nothing left for you! I, uh, oh. I think he might have actually unplugged his controller for- Okay, we're just gonna, um, get this guy out. Yeah, there we go. I am... <clears throat> Uh, well, GG, well played. Now this right here is a fight. We got the best character in the game up against the worst character in the game. I'm at a pretty steep disadvantage here, but my saving grace is the fact that unlike this DDD, I'm not a complete fucking idiot. Oh my god. Do you feel it coming on? Sound the alarms, I feel one coming! This DDD is shifting in to m m m m m maximum autism overload! But for real, for real, does this guy actually think I'm gonna fall for the old suck and cuck, my own patented move? I don't think so. Get out of my face. Thank you very much. Now I wonder, is he gonna recover with an up B? Gee, I don't know. Hmm, who would have guessed? I'm so good at reading things. How, how did I know it was coming? It was so unpredictable! Way to go, DDD! It's time to face the ultimate challenger, myself! You know, this actually reminds me a lot of the ancient Chinese proverb, uh, how, how does it go again? Uh, trust nobody, not even yourself. Because my little Mac skills have achieved god status, i.e. my ability to forward smash, this unfortunate soul seems like he really just can't keep up. Hold up though, ready for this? Are you watching? Watch closely, cause I'ma do it again. Bonk! There it is, boys! God, I almost feel bad for this Little Mac, I really do. One like equals one prayer. One share equals uh, a, a, a thousand prayers, because Lord knows this man needs some divine intervention in his life. Now, this, this is just flat out unfair. I mean, come on, how are you gonna put someone with a sword the size of their entire body up against a tiny manly with boxing gloves? I mean, come on, Nintendo, please, balance your game. Here's another example of Little Mac's awesome recovery abilities, as well as Cloud's awesome edge guarding abilities. Now, you see, that would have actually worked if he was, you know, not shit at the game. Up oh, there he goes again, throwing out that up B, getting himself killed like the absolute buffoon he is. Man, some of these people just never learn, do they? So, yeah, that's basically all there really is to Little Mac. Run fast, hit hard, fuck him up, GG. Now, I've actually saved my greatest piece of advice for the last portion of this video, just as a reward for all the people that have stuck with me this far. So here is what you really gotta do as Little Mac. When you're going to pick him in the character select screen, what you actually 
probably want to do is pick Game & Watch instead. Or, alternatively, literally any of the other 57 characters in this game, because fuck Little Mac, he is god-awful. That's all the time we have for today. Thank you all for watching, and make sure to smash that motherfucking like button fam on your way to the door.